Hey guys, welcome back. It's your girl Sade and welcome to Sade's Mix. If you're new here, hi, welcome. And if you're returning, thank you so much. Today's video is going to be a hidden gem right here in South Florida called Super Blue. I'm so excited to share this with you guys. But before I go any further, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring that bell so that you are notified. Hey, it's your girl back again with another voiceover attempt. So as stated, we are going to discuss Super Blue today, which is located in the heart of Miami. It's a museum that deals with nature and how it is interchangeable with technology. I will, of course, list the description down below in my description box. Please take a look and please, 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 please go see this exhibit when you first enter the exhibit this is the very first thing that you are going to walk into and for me it was like stepping under the clouds look how beautiful that is the music that is playing in the background comes directly from the exhibit itself and it just gave me a sense of peace and a sense of relaxation while walking and going through all the exhibits now me and Jasper were able to go through most of the exhibits. A lot of the exhibits, unfortunately, they do not allow any recording, so we don't have a lot of that. But look at this beauty. So these are the interchangeable walls and they change. They have animals, they have flowers, they have lights. It is just an awe-inspiring place to just be a part of and it's quiet and I absolutely love that. Look at this wall art. Yeah, I know I love you know I love flowers, right? Look how beautiful this is. I definitely tried to take photos, but since I'm still learning my camera, unfortunately I don't have too many photos, but I did did actually want to capture the beauty that I was seeing. And look at this. I'm a huge fan of sunflowers, and this I just had to take a video and share it with you guys. The interchangeable walls really made you feel calm, relaxed, at peace, as I stated. It almost was like I had smoked before I went in there, but I didn't. Just letting y'all know, I was, I felt that relaxed. So as you see here, I'm still trying to figure out my camera, and I am sorry for the shaky quality. They wouldn't allow me to have my stabilizer, and that sucks, but I know you're supposed to be a part of the experience, so whatever and I was absolutely submerged in it I kept coming back to this room because I was kind of confused I wasn't understanding what was going on but after a couple minutes you start to see the birth of the flowers as you can see right there they bloom they die and they go through that cycle it's just showing you how the cycle of life is really and how important it is for us to be aware of our surroundings where we stand and how we affect nature such an amazing place to be honestly guys I absolutely recommend please take a time out of your day to take your kids here and just let them be inspired because I was absolutely was look at that it's just so beautiful and as I stated a lot of the exhibits inside would not allow us to record and that's fine this is my favorite exhibit it is the mirror room we call it the John Wick Room. If anyone's seen John Wick 3, you guys know what I'm talking about. That awesome fight scene. Look at my, look at me. Ow. Hi, guys. And look at my skin popping. I look great. Can't complain. <laughs> Sorry. But no, look at the room. So in this room, it was supposed to be to see yourself in different avenues and reflect on how easily we are surrounded by everyone and anyone. As I stated, this is definitely a John Wick scenario. I was ready to go pow, pow, pow. I know I love me some Keanu Reeves. I love him. That's my other boyfriend. Again, I was feeling myself. Sorry, guys. I couldn't help it. So as I stated, a lot of the inside of the exhibits were... Um, interactive so there was things that you are able to submerge yourself i had to come back to this room because look at this look at this beautiful like room peace serenity i just felt so calm and someone who struggles with very bad anxiety and depression this place once i left i just felt at peace at ease just really recentered and balanced and i recommend if you're struggling with any of that to please 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 come to this exhibit, you will be happy that you did. And here is my epic fail on trying to record the room and my dad walk, as I call it. So as you see, 
just going down the steps of the mirror room. I really thought I was in a John Wick movie. I'm sorry, I couldn't help it. Now, what was really fascinating about this room, this room had no sound. And with all the people that were there, it was almost like if someone sneezed, you heard it. Like, it was so breathtaking to not hear the outside world, not hear anyone else, and just hear your own breathing. This is one of the artists, unfortunately, I wasn't able to record his room, but he dealt with the illusion of um, colors, and I was tripping out in there. Um, I thought it was amazing. I started to cry a little bit. Um, I don't know why, but it just really got to me with the color trend. Um, translation I, I it really hit me in a really sensitive spot and i i appreciated that thank you for watching of course guys don't forget to hit that subscribe button and i'll be seeing you guys next sunday for another true crime video bye